everyone we are coming from our little computer corner of our shoebox of a house this is where i edit a ton of videos for y'all on the other channel and just do a lot of work anywho i am doing a giveaway from some of the goodies that i got from the farmhouse sale if you haven't seen that vlog go over and check that out um but yeah i just got a ton of a ton of like um a ton of goodies and i was like well let's let's do a giveaway so what do we have in this giveaway? Um, let me show you. I've got like this basket and it is plum full of um, yummy, yummy fabric. Henry wants to like eat all of it, okay? So <laughs> it might arrive to the winner with some baby drool. This is like some neat ribbon. It has a very vintage feel to it. I actually got two of these because I, I just thought they were really neat and I wanted to keep one for myself. So that is gonna be included with the giveaway. Henry, why don't you play with that, sweetie? Okay. Isn't that nice? And then as you may have seen in the vlog, um, the whip stitch piping, unfortunately, is going away. Um, at least for the time being. It sort of broke my heart a little bit. But um, I gobbled up a ton of it, and I thought this yellow... Audrey, please don't do that. I thought this yellow would be a great giveaway because it's gender neutral, and just you can do... I think it's a shade that you could do, like, heirloom stuff with it. You could do classic themes. I mean, you could just kind of... Let your imagination run wild. It's um, fairly uh, an easy shade of yellow to kind of do what you want with it. If that makes some sense. So that will be in the giveaway. One of my favorite things. And then there's just a ton of fabric. And these are like cutoffs. You know, they're ranging from, I don't know, a quarter of a yard to a yard. Maybe a yard and a half for some of them. I think most of them are around half a yard or so, but I mean there's, you know, silk dupanone. Does that silk not look familiar, right? From um, a dress I made for Audrey, I think it was last summer. And then we've got some red silk dupanone. Um, here's some pink voil. Actually, that looks like Nola. That is Nola. Yeah, that's Nola, um, which is a Batiste that I just love. It kind of has that shimmery, wonderful quality to you, which I'm sure the inserts that I'm putting for my cell phone is not picking up. Um, it's not doing it justice, but it is coming to you with a little bit of baby drool. <laughs> and um, it's yummy goodness, as you can see. Henry, sweetie, honestly, play with this. Thank you. <laughs> um, there's just a lovely hodgepodge. There's there's some linen in here. Um, there's a lot of batiste. Here is some Italian cotton. If you've never felt Italian cotton, whoo, go get you some. It is amazing. Like there's like this wonderful crisp coolness, cool softness. You know what I mean to it. It's wonderful. Like it would make a fabulous pillowcase. I probably should do that. Um, more silk dupanone. All right. Um, that looks like some imperial batiste. We've got, ooh, this is the same stuff that I'm using this year for Henry's Easter uh, outfit. It is a cotton polyester blend. I think there's a little bit of a stain right here, so cut around that. But it's a, um, it's a cotton polyester blend, and it has this little, like, uh, has this little stripe in it. It's from France. It's gorgeous. Uh, Henry, seriously. Uh, some more batiste. Ooh, there's some piquet in Daddy, here. I'm Teddy. Uh, Henry, you are not making this easy. Do you know that? Uh, Audrey's bouquet. Why don't you go play with some toys? All right, here's some more bouquet. Um, there's like a waffle weave bouquet, which is lovely. Um, I do like bouquet. You like bouquet? Yeah. Oh, yeah, me too. Me too. Me too. Your birthday dress is going to be bouquet this year. There's more bouquet here. Um, more Italian cotton. And so you got to think when you're going through these things, because it's not going to be like a you know, a huge amount of any one fabric. So you gotta think you make a bottom of a bubble with this, you can make the top of a dress with that, you know what I mean? Like match, you know, match things up, get creative with it. Um, 
You could, of course, make a scrap quilt. I've got a blog on that, on how I'm making a quilt out of my scraps, and that's, of course, an ongoing project. I really like the project because, you know, I've heard... Audrey, shh. Oh, isn't that pretty? Oh, my goodness. I have heard from um, ladies that, you know, their kids are grown and whatnot, and then they go back through their, through their clothing, and they make a quilt out of the clothing, and I'm like, that's... That I'm not going to be cutting out their clothing to make a quilt out of it. I mean, you do you. Like, that, if that rocks your, your socks, go for it. But I'm not going to cut into these clothing. But I love the idea of, like, these are the scraps from, from your Easter dress in this dress, or in this quilt. You know, here's your Easter dress, here's your, here's your birthday dress, here's a, a special occasions, you know, whatever wedding we went to that year, and have that be, like, the quilt of, of memories. Um, something that's a little bit more practical they can snuggle up with, and and you can, you know, you know what I mean? It's not like tucked away with all the clothing or something. Oh, here is some. Um, What's that? This is dotted Swiss. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, it's white. It's white with white dots. It's yeah. so pretty. It's a piece. So pretty. Yeah. Here is. What's this that? was wild to find this What's because that? this is waffle bouquet. And I'm I made. It's not Audrey's. What? I made a dress out of this stuff um, for m myself. Um, oh my gosh, many moons ago, like five years ago. That one, I was well rested and said for myself. So here is some um, like silk shirt mousse, and we've got more waffle bouquet, or no, just bouquet, more bouquet. Yeah, more oh, bouquet. Okay. Um, then there's some green um, silk de pugnone. Here is some organza, which would be, there's actually quite a bit of this organza. Um, so this would be like wow, wonderful for, isn't it pretty? Yeah, It'd be yeah, a great, Audrey. it's not Audrey, sweetie, Watch. because we're giving it away. Okay. okay. <laughs> It would make like you know a really pretty overlay, and even if you don't see yourself doing that, there's a very practical side of organza. If you they make wonderful presser claws, so there you have it. I'm gonna try to cram all of this into a medium size um, shipping box. I actually got this one. Let me go get that. Okay. Oh no, I got the one that opened sideways. Why? Because <laughs> I was in a rush and I wasn't paying any attention. So yeah, I'll get the right size box. I will mail it off to the lucky winner and mwah. Oh, to win. Okay, so you do have to be in the United States. Mwah. You got kisses? Mwah. He has such good kisses. Um, you do have to be in the United States to win. Mwah. Because I'm just going to use a flat rate priority mwah box. And I'm going to cram as much of this fabric as I can Mwah. to the winner. Oh, my God. Um, to win, just please comment down below that you are interested. Um, if you want to give, like, a snid bit about yourself or if you just want to say, hey, I'm interested or I'd like to win or just leave a comment, a friendly comment. Um, of course, you've got to be subscribed to the channel. And there you have it. So, um, I'll just sweetie. I know, this is this is reality. Y'all seem to like these videos though, which is good because those are the only ones I can produce without a voiceover and all that jazz. So anywho, um <laughs> Hi. Mwah. So anywho, I hope you all enjoyed that vlog from Farmhouse and seeing a little bit of their store. I uh, always appreciate y'all for watching and I hope to catch y'all next time.